here we are. That's Chief. Hey. Hey. And over there, say hello to Joel. Hi. Joel's, Joel's been here before. Chief is new in. And uh, what we're doing is we're putting the foam in and then sealing it up so that it's nice and airtight layer. And this is actually the second layer of it. There's a first layer going in up here. And it's all these little nooks and crannies. Let me show you how messy of a job this is. You think, I want to build a boat. Boat building's fun. He is caulking each of those panels in very diligently. And this is a, this is a PL300 foam yep. adhesive. Yeah. I'll see y'all later. All right, yeah. yeah. See you. All right. Cool. Thanks, Joel. So that has been done all the way through here once all that's done. That was just my block that fell out. I'm going to have to glue that back in. We're going to put this uh, wood paneling on here. Actually, it's not wood, it's not paneling. It's uh, Actually, this stuff is like almost one inch thick. Red cedar. Siding. Yeah, siding. Cedar. Oh, wouldn't be siding on the inside. Would you guys grow red cedar out where you're at, don't you? Yep. It's a, actually, that's a parasite wood. It's just... Yeah, it fell out right from there. I thought I'd glue it in with some of that cedar because I messed up my glue. I'm not going to open up a new, new tube to do that. I'll break that up. You know what? Maybe put a piece of foam. I will. Yeah, okay. What we do is we brace stuff up every once in a while. All right, I'm going to take these good folks out and show them the doors that we've been working on. Can I bring you back anything, Chief? No, sir. I'm good. Okay. And Betsy might be down there watching comments. Oh, it stopped raining and the sun came out. How lovely. How lovely. Oh, there's somebody with a teardrop trailer down there. I bet they're coming to visit. We got the fan on. Push some air down into there. And we're working on the doors to the pilot house. Um, got a video that'll be out this week with... Uh, Don and Ruth and uh, Sarah were up here from um, what's the Lady Do is the name of their boat. So you can find them on YouTube and Facebook. And they have a uh, oh, it looks like Joel's going to give a tour through here. They have their own website. And here's the door. I saw a little trailer go by that way. Now that's another to somebody else. Yeah, I heard from them. Morning, Miss Betsy. Morning. How you doing? Fine, we got three there and yeah, those are Joel's buddies. No, they aren't. They're not? No, neither is the one with the trailer. Oh, really? But I've got them signing them in. Just oh, to... I thought that was Joel's ride. No. All right. Let me show you the door. We got it working. I'm ha very happy with this. Um, it took a lot of work to figure it out. But the way it is, it's all latched internally. And uh, it, it wasn't easy, but what happens is this we're going to use one of our tentacle handles that goes on right there and all of this will get covered up by this hatch which has a bushing in it so this thing is stabilized with the bushing on the bottom side and the way it works is when it opens it'll latch and when it closes it latches and the latches are on springs so it doesn't matter what you're doing with the handle then the latch will lock on and as you turn the handle to pull the door that way, this one unlatches. And if you turn the handle to pull the door this way, that one over there unlatches. So you can unlatch the door and then keep pulling in the same direction. So, very happy about that. Yeah, it worked and we're, we spent a lot of time trying to figure that one out. Boy, there it is. Are right, you gonna read questions? I'm, I'm catching up. Right when I was getting started. Yeah. You guys coming through for a tour? Yes, sir. Anybody mind being on camera live? No, not at all. all right. I've been watching you since day one build this thing. Is that right? Yeah. I'm Doug. Yeah. yeah. Dave Anderson. Dave Anderson. And Diana. Diana. Nice to meet you, Diana. It's my son, Jake. 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 Nice to meet you. We're from St. Louis. We're in town for my grandson's graduation. Is that right? What you graduating from? High school? High school. Oh, good. Come from on through. Carroll High School. Um, I tell you what, you signed the paperwork. We're just gonna let you roam. Okay. 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 Because I'm gonna, uh, we'll, do, we'll do this. Uh, we got a brand new gangway put in. What, what do you do for a living? I don't. I do this for a living now. Really? <laughs> yeah, this is my living now. I retired like uh, end of 
April. What did you do then? I was an Oracle database administrator. You for, have to learn how to do all the welding and mold, make building your own mold. No, that's that. just that's just watching YouTube and figuring it out. So you just, went, you yeah. just winged it all. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. We've been winging it since I was, you know. I remember when you was putting the first up. two sheets of steel together. Watching that, I mean, it was. Like, <laughs> You've been watching for a long time. Yeah. I've yeah. been watching this since the beginning. Yeah. It's well, amazing. I just don't know how the hell you're gonna get this thing down the road. You have to take the. We got the wheels out there. See that that set of wheels yeah, there? Like There's clear, another. Clear everything. Oh, so the pilot house comes off. You gonna take it back off? Okay. Yeah, it's just bolted on, and then the davits will cut them loose. So, so it's going to be below 14 feet. Mm, it'll be 16 feet. 16 yeah, feet. Yeah, from the top of the bow to the bottom of the keel is 16 feet. You clocked? Have you mapped out a route already? You know what's really cool? As backwards as Oklahoma is on most things, you can go online 24-7 and you can put in your your starting, your ending points, your height, your weights, and all that stuff. And our route you? The GIS system will print you out a route and you pay by a credit card for your fee and that's it. You gotta have an escort car and whatever else, yeah. you know, to tell you what you need for that and you're gone because we build so much big stuff here for the oil industry. Right. That it's just a common thing. Where's your little lifeboat you was building? Oh, it's in the backyard. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Wander around and take a look at it. And you guys are welcome to go up on the boat. Okay, just thank don't, you. don't break yourself. <laughs> Chief, uh, Chief is inside. Okay. So uh, say hello to him when you get there. Um, backyard, which way? Who was, backyard? Who was it? Was <laughs> backyards back? Yeah. Back, well, <laughs> back in the back. Yeah. yeah. Wander around. Yeah. Go around the, through the driveway over there. Okay. And let me know how much water's down in the bottom of it, if you would. Okay, well, I'm not sure how much it rained the other day. Who was here last week? It was, um... <sighs> Don and Sarah. No, uh -huh. Don and Sarah. Also with Don and Sarah. Oh. Francis. Francis and... Don and Sarah. No. Missing one. No. Yes. Yes. I don't know. Let's ask everybody else to tell us who was here last weekend since we can't remember. I just, I'm just drawing a blank. Are you sure you're not talking about the weekend before? No, yeah, okay, weekend before. Bonjour. Oh, Maxime. Yeah. Maxime. Maxime was the guy that, that worked this out with me. That's who that was. Yeah, so Maxime and I came up with this, this design. It was Chief who's in there now. He, he and I put it together. Yeah. So anyway, I'm, we got to build one more, and then the other thing we got to do, we got a lot more work to do on these doors because, you know, they've been welded all on one side, and so it's got, you know, it, let's see, it curves, you know, so it would have drawn it, so it would've, it'll be bent like this, and we got the same issue up on the back of the pilot house. It's uh, where we welded the out exterior plate onto the pilot house. It bent the, uh, it you know, bent the whole wall. Make sure you're up all the way. I am up all the way. Are you sure? Or are you just saying? Well, that? the volume on the phone doesn't change for your microphone. Yes, you can alternate it. Really? I think. All right, here I'll no, do that. Underneath. Yeah, that's right down there. All right, we're gonna rock you guys around for a little bit. So right there. Yeah, it's all the way up. Okay. Yeah. Are they complaining about sound no, again? No, it is. Right. I told them it'd be better later. Yeah, it'd be better later. What we do is we'll uh, we'll upload the other camera later. So. Is your cat going to go s when it's... No, Earl is not going to go. Earl will kill everything on the boat. Okay, now what do you got, Miss Betsy? Oh, huh? well, one, let's let's say thank you for the great oh, response. Yeah, absolutely. We've had a fantastic notice, response. Notice my display case here. It's kind Carved, of ratty. Carved but out I of understand foam. Scott's making me a pretty one. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, well, it's not hard to make pretty ones out of this. Yeah, what's really cool, guys, is uh, we've sold enough of these that they're, the cost of them is all paid for. And each of those boats will get at least uh, $500 this month. Probably, uh, well, Leo will get 1000 or so. And we're halfway through selling out on our coins. So that means 250 more to go, and we're done. Now, we were so surprised by yeah. the success of this. Yeah. That we obviously weren't ready. No. So immediately after day one, which I spent two days totally just packing and shipping, um, we placed 
an order that was considerably even larger than our first order. The problem is it takes a while for them to cast them and get them to us. So um, we have a huge back order list. However, we have got enough coming in to cover that. And I'm probably going to place another order after the weekend. However, if you ordered something along with, I mean, we're totally out right now of Seeker Coins and Tally Ho Coins. If you ordered any other coin and not one of those, sometimes I'm sending them out. Don't worry, I've got good records. But if you've ordered like a mug or a shirt or a hat or something or a poster, I've gone ahead and shipped that item to you, I think in nearly most every case. And some of you kind of freaked out. You said, but I ordered a coin too and all I'm good at is a cup. Yeah, come so, on here, guys. Um, so what that means is as soon as the coins come in, I'll pack them and ship them. We'll pay for the shipping ourselves and um and we'll get them out to you so um it's your choice if you want to get on the back order list or which means for sure i'll get enough in um like i said right now i'm i'm good and and um it takes two to three weeks i'm hoping it'll only be two which would be in another week and a half and of course they'll send these out to you right away also we have already have another one that oh, will yeah. be released the first of June, middle of June probably. Yeah. Um, and we're really excited about that. And another one you're talking possibly, about. Possibly. Yeah. Possibly we'll add uh, Life on the Mold and uh, Frantic Sailing, or is it Sailing Frantic? Frantic Sailing. It's Frantic Sailing Adventures. Our yeah. Irish Phoenix. Yes. Yeah. As we like to call him, otherwise known as Reese. Reese. Reese yes. out there. Yeah. Then. We have this lovely new shirt. Oh yeah. Okay. Now, granted, the model isn't the best, <laughs> but Robin couldn't make it this morning. Yeah. But what a great t-shirt. What a great shirt this would be for Robin in a wet t-shirt contest, oh, yeah. wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. And they're in lady sizes, um, small to 3X, maybe four. I'm not sure. You'll have to look. But um, there's just a limited amount of them, and they're great. They fit very they're very form fitting so if you want it kind of loose like me because you're trying to you know yeah. make room for a muffin or two you're going to want to go up a size okay okay now we need to introduce our newest crew member oh yeah 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 we got lyle chief lyle i know lyle who's lyle I joel i'm reading comments too and trying to think of things i'm talking about i'm talking about our other guy oh our newest crew member. bob Shh, don't tell him the name yet. Well, the name's great, Bob. He's a good listener. Yes. He doesn't have a leg to stand on. <laughs> He's not much of a hands-on guy. Yeah. He's shoulders above the rest of us. Yeah. He sticks his neck out for anybody. He's tough-skinned. He can lose his head. He's kind of lost his head. But he's there when you need him. And he gets in and out of tight places and yeah. no buts about it. <laughs> he is not much of a swimmer. Now, drum yeah. roll, please. Yeah. Oh, you got Bob here? Oh, Bob's oh, buying the... Bob's here. Oh, there's Bob. Yeah. There's Bob. Here's Bob. Now. Now, his middle name is Matthew. That's when he sits on the front porch. Yeah. Matt. <laughs> and he's, yeah. Also, he's also a cross-dresser. Yes, yes. He, he modeled our ladies' The, the ladies' t-shirt and Betsy, and, Betsy and stuffed him. I didn't. Bob did it. No, Bob used bubble wrap. It was really anyway, embarrassing. Look at this shirt. This is just stunning, and it's oh, now in the shop. Us? Yeah. Cool. This is the 5050 jersey polyester cotton polo shirt with the perlite buttons. It's a Hanes shirt, so it fits the same sizes like the T-shirts. It's in sizes men, small, all the way up to 6x wow now sizes five and six are in black because they were not available in this lovely navy blue all right with our blueprint logo oh black makes you look sl slimmer too. absolutely and the best thing is you will not believe the price i got such a deal and you'll have yeah. to go to the website and look at it but the price makes this for a polo shirt this is absolutely a deal you can't refuse on our website Yes. Well, that's surprising. Okay. Okay. Now, don't what else? forget, we have these. Oh yeah. These Got caps too. Caps, and they're going really fast. But, but, I really like them with the embroidery. Same. They're nice. Same thing. Oh, yeah. And Bob's doing such a good job. 
Oh yeah, he's got dirt and on him. Also, More? also, well, um, I'm finally the shop is filling up again. I have all the black, the proper black tea in all sizes now. That's restocked, and the maker shirts. I am processing them today, so by tonight they'll all be on there. And I now offer the maker shirt up to yes, size six X. Wow. So guys, all right, get in there. All right, listen, if if you're a size six X. Boy. All right, that's big. That's really big. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go show him. Uh, I'm gonna go show Rich his uh, pumpkins here. Yeah, when Rich was here, he gave me some pumpkins. That was the guy before Maxine. And we've whittled it down, Rich, to two pumpkins. I am impressed. These things grow like freaking weeds. Okay. All right, just for there. See how big that leaf is. Look at your weeds. This is amazing. Yeah, I know. I gotta mow. But that's not till Wednesday. I don't have to mow till Wednesday. Like mulch that and strong. those of you that are missing the, the tinder, there it is. It's sitting over there. Amongst, if anybody needs to buy a radiator or an intercooler for a Cummins 5.9, there they are. Or an extra trailer tire. Along with the fuel tanks out there. We don't have. Yeah, that's true. I got a trailer tire sale too. Nobody's called me about the trailer tire. I thought I priced that right. Hmm. I guess not. And there's our tomato plant. Joel in there, uh, who you met, the crew guy. He's also a gardener, so he's giving us some tips about how to take care of tomatoes. I didn't know you had to prune them back. Oh, yes, we do. There's the other door. That's the inside. That, that was the one we need to get the latches on. And let's see. Once we get the foam in, we do the wood. Oh, I still got those batteries out there. I got to charge those up. The VMAC will be the uh, the engine that we run the uh, charger for those. We got to give them a real heavy charge. So some have asked about those. They're still there and still waiting patiently. The chemistry is right in them. They just gotta be hit hard with the charge. And we've got just that little stack of boards over there left the plane. Francis and Bart have been doing all that. <laughs> and for those of you who are interested in Francis, he sent me a video today. He was uh, sitting in a rail yard on a freight train in San Antonio. Oh, oh no, nobody called the cops. He's left there by now. Um, San Antonio, Texas, and uh, he uh, uh, had free Wi-Fi that he picked up. So he he uh, filmed some trains going by, and so that's where he was. Actually, I don't think that was today, was yesterday. You know, there's a guy that hopefully he's heading west. Silence. Well, silencing. I, I, I'm on me. I'm not on you. Uh, remember, we got this one rule that's real easy. If, you get uh, to be obnoxious. Yeah, you're gone. And, and you know who you are. Yeah, it's unfortunate. You know, it's like there's a lot of people out there in pain. I think a lot of times that pain gets expressed as just being, uh, you know, a dick, unfortunately. So it's kind of sad. Uh, I hope you get to feeling better. I hope your life turns to be something good. I hope you can see that, you know, it's a, we've got a good thing going on here on this planet. All right, I got some guests up there. I got to go say hello to. Walk through the boat. This is Saturday tour day. And so there's somebody, let me show you this though. I haven't greeted them yet, but somebody pulled up here with that. Let me get a closer view of it. Okay, that is a cool make, all right? And I've seen a couple of these around those teardrop tra trailers. It's nice to see those back. And I think that was home built. If I'm right, that's a Harbor Freight uh, trailer sitting underneath the thing. All right, Tinka, ready to go? You got anything else to say? There's all of our cedar chips. Anybody need some cedar, red cedar chips, let me know. I can set you up. We'll probably get, be doing some dragon eggs with them later on, but not right now. And our garden is coming along beautifully. Betsy picked up some marigolds yesterday we'll put out. Jalapenos, and I don't know, and squash, and bell pepper, and I don't know. So there we go, and this lovely tomato plant. All right, that's all I got. You got any questions on there that I should answer? You know, nothing worthwhile answering. Okay. Mostly there. Yeah, that's the gate. Uh, and we fixed the gate bell. Where's Bart? Bart should be here. Bart should be here. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you all for joining us. There it is. What'd you make today?